today we're gonna paint this million dollar house and we're gonna turn it from this to this. Let's show you how we did it. Now, let's get into the step-by-step -step process of how we paint this house. First step, you gotta prep and clean your area and get rid of all the debris that are on there. So first up, here I'm taking our Honda gas pressure washer, gonna go take it to the hardy board siding to get that stuff super clean. We're getting it free of all the dirt, all the grease, all the grime, so that the paint will stick really nice. Next up, you gotta tape all your windows off. This is one of the most important steps in painting, actually, if not the most important step. It's gonna take the most time and the most dedication, but once you do it right, it'll make the job way better. Next up, we're moving the skyjack to the hard to reach places that we can't reach from the ground, like our really tall windows and all of our soffits. We made sure to do a really good job taping off all of our cedar in both the walls and the soffits because any paint that gets on the wood is a real pain in the ass to get off. In the mornings, it can get a little wet, so I'm wiping off some of the water here to make sure our paint sticks real nice. We use both an X5 and X7 Graco paint sprayer. This is one of our favorite sprayers to use. It works great for all types of applications and has never done us wrong. When we were designing the house, we really wanted this thing to pop out and stand out among the rest of them. So we went with a black tar paint from Benjamin Moore. The gray paint you see here is also a Benjamin Moore product called Steel Wool. You know we rock with Benjamin. It's very important when doing a project of this size that you use a paint sprayer. There's no way we could paint this entire house in the time frame we did with rollers and other utilities. So that's how you paint a million dollar house. Stay tuned and subscribe for our next video.